Hello everyone, welcome to Tesca Technologies Private Limited. My name is Vishesh Dave and today we are going to discuss about ISDN Trainer Kit which is basically Integrated Services Digital Network. Its order code is 40553A and in this video we are going to discuss about its application, its working and its components. This is an ISDN trainer kit. Its full form is Integrated Services Digital Network. It is a circuit switch telephone network system that transmits both data and voice over a digital line. You can also think of it as a set of communication standards to transmit data, voice and signaling. ISDN connections have a reputation for providing better speeds and higher quality than traditional connections. Faster speeds and better connections allow data transmission to travel more reliably. So this is a ISDN trainer kit. Firstly, we have main AC input by which we can get AC supply. Secondly, we have DSL splitter. This splitter in which ISDN cable is connected at input port and it splits the telephone and modem at the same time. Right now, we will not use this due to the unavailability of ISDN cable. Then we will have router. Router is used for two things. First is internet connectivity. Second is data transmission. For data transmission, it is used for transmitting data from one network to the other devices. Second, for internet connectivity, it provides internet access to local networks LAN as well as wide area networks WNS over ISDN lines. Useful for a for internet connectivity. It provides internet access to local area networks as well as wide area networks over IGN lines. Then we have Cisco 1841. Cisco 1841 acts as a server which is used for the interfacing and communication between multiple PCs or devices. One input port, ISDN, BRI port and we have four output ports. So after discussing all the components, now we'll move forward to its working. Initially, we have to do the switch on the main supply and afterwards we have to make a connection between router and the Ethernet so that it can access the Internet. And after this, we have to make connection between router and the star topology with the help of RJ45 cables. And uh, we have to make connection between one of the cables and the PCs. Now we have to connect three PCs so that it can get internet connectivity at the same time. Now after the completion of start topology, we have come to bus topology to check if the internet is working or not. So initially we have to connect one port to the router and these three cables, RJ45 cables are connected directly to three PCs. And just like the other two topologies, we have to connect ring topology with the other devices, PC devices with the help of RS232 cables for data transmission. It is used for data transmission only. It is not used for internet connectivity. So that's all from my side. If you have any queries related to this trainer kit, you can visit Tesca global website. The link is in the description or you can go through the manual. Thanks for watching this video. If you like it, like, share and subscribe the channel.